And over here, you'll see the oatmeal room. This is where we keep the oatmeal. Aren't Zoofies our cutest customers ever? I know. <laughs> and they're so friendly. And next on our tour is uh, our hallway. And here are some windows. There goes a shooting star. And here comes Sal. Welcome, Zoofies! We're the friendliest place in space! So I hope you have a happy visit! <laughs> and this is our library! Where we have all kinds of books! We have books about planets, and books about math, and books on how to make smoothies! Oh, hey, Jet! <laughs> and my favorite books of all, the Stacy series! Stacy and the Crab Nebula, Stacy and the Supernova, Stacy and the... Huh? That's weird. Where'd all the Zoofies go? They couldn't have just disappeared. Or could they? <laughs> Can Zoofies do that? No. They're around here somewhere. Come on out, guys. What's wrong? Uh, I think they're scared. But of what? It's okay, guys. Don't be scared. You ready to go back to our tour? The greenhouse is where we grow all kinds of fruits and veggies. Here are some carrots and cucumbers. <laughs> And here's the berry patch. <laughs> and over here is the orchard. Hey there, Jet. Where we grow stuff like apples, pears, and peaches. In fact, we... Huh? Not again. Where'd they disappear to this time? <laughs> what are you doing up there? Come on down. Come on. Let's go see what's wrong. What's the matter, guys? <laughs> you mean, you're scared? That's terrible. Of what? <laughs> you're scared of... a monster? <laughs> but there aren't any monsters around here. He's right. And even if there were, we'd never let him hurt you. Yeah, come on down. It's safe. Are you guys ready for the rest of the tour? <laughs> Look! Ta-da! Is nice and quiet. All you'll find there are beautiful stars and planets. Uh huh. And here's the best view from the space station. Clark, what's going on? What's wrong? What are you so afraid? You mean, you're scared of... Jet? But that's impossible! Jet's the sweetest guy around! Wait, let me try something. <laughs> Gee, I guess you're right. They really are scared of Jet. Why is everyone in here instead of out there with our new guests? I'm afraid it's Jet. For some reason, the Zoofies are scared of you. Well, you can see why. If I didn't know Jet, I'd be scared of him too. I mean, you are kind of big. Radar! And green. Radar! And your teeth are a little... 
Pointy. Radar! What? Don't listen to him, Jet. We love you. The Zofies are only afraid of you because they don't know you. Like my Gam Gam says, to know a cuttlefish is to love a cuttlefish. That means if our guests are afraid of you, all you have to do is be yourself and show them that you're not scary. See you later, alligator, and good luck. Sal's right. You've got to go out there and make the Zoofies like you. Use those pointy teeth and make a friendly jet smile. Bigger. Even bigger. That's it! Now, go out there and smile. And give them one of your big jet hugs. They're gonna love that! Okay, guess it's time for plan B. I think they're okay. I brought them some more smoothies and calmed them down. I still don't know what went wrong, but I've got it now. Those Zoofies don't know how fun you are, but once they see for themselves, they're going to love you. Now listen closely. <laughs> It's working like a charm. Nice. It was an honest mistake. Maybe the Zoofies are over it. Uh, guess not. Hmm, I'm still not sure what went wrong. Unless they're just scared of the way you look. We know how cute you are, but maybe we should disguise you so you're just a little less scary looking to Zoofies. Puffy pom-poms, puffy pom-poms. Fuzzy fabric, fuzzy fabric. Googly eyes, googly eyes! There! It's perfect! What could be less scary than a baby penguin? I don't know, Comet. Are you sure that's going to work? Of course it is! He looks totally harmless. Now, waddle for me. Come on, get into it. Like this! Great! Now go out there and charm those Zoofies! Don't stare, but I think someone let in a giant penguin. Suppose you want to try something else? Like maybe a cute little pony? Cobbit, I think Sal was right. Don't try too hard and don't put on costumes. Just go out there and be yourself. How about a baby kitten? Thanks, Jet. Thank you. Thanks, Jet. <laughs> Some moves, Jet. Nice job. I'm okay. Uh oh.
I guess Sal's Gam Gam was right. The best thing was for Jet to be himself. I still don't know why those Zoopies were so scared. <laughs> Imagine being frightened of someone as nice as Jet. Yeah, they just had to get to know him, that's all. 